everyone, we are so glad you are still with us as we continue to the final match of round one of the TTI Twisted Tree Line Invitational. As, as at least 40% of the time, it is I, Sig, and the eternal, immortal, fantastic uh, love of my life, Nickel. Nickel, how you doing? If you keep making me blush, I'm not going to have that much blood in my vessels. But um, yes, I'm still here. Well, uh, I will I will have expectations when the stream is over, so just remember that. <laughs> uh, well, folks, we are moving into this match, but it is going to be an exciting one as we are looking at Treeline Victors versus Angry Mob. Angry Mob is a group of players that were put together by chance uh, as they didn't have teams to join, so they are very upset, disgruntled, and looking for a win. So... We are going to go ahead and start that match. Very excited for this pick band phase. And it would appear that I have remembered to push the button this time. Yay! Yay! 10 out of 10. Big gains, big gains, folks. That's all we're about. Big gains. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to donate right now, so I might be quiet a little bit. Well, I hope all of our listener friends will join in on this donation hype train. We're already starting to get some donations in. We'll brief about that at the end of this match. I do see the Callista ban come across, that more than likely is targeted. A uh, Scion ban coming from the Angry Mob. I do not tolerate cowardice. And then we see Cho'Gath and Darius come across, making sure these bruisers and these tanks have no foothold in this very hardy, highest elevated point uh, in League of Legends. Because technically, there are steps in this one. Uh, two tier steps at the fountain, where... Summoner's Rift only has one tier of steps, uh, so this is the highest playable point in the game. Verified facts, folks. That's what we're about here. All right. Great beard of Odin. We spelled KDA. You did. You did. You did. I am so proud of you. I can't can't put to words how excited I am. Um, and we do see the allow pick allowy pick coming from the angry mob while the tree line victors that's victors with a K uh, pick up Nico new champ uh, first time being seen tonight. Uh, this was picked a whole lot over the past week at the All Star event hosted by our. Um, little brother the LCS. Uh, one less letter, which means they're inferior. We see the Urgot pick come across from Great Beard of Odin. We see that a lot during the regular LCS, so I think that's probably him. Um, Maya Chan picking up Kane and Bryho, uh, we're going to call you B, uh, picks up the Lux. Lots of CC there. And they spelled KDA with their bands, and they spelled, they spelled none, none with their picks. Um, ah. And Kane Alawi Lux spelled kill, and now they're lick. This is lick versus none, folks. We have no control over this stream anymore. Uh, folks, this is very exciting as we move into this final match, the Angry Mob versus... Alright. I uh, donated. I'm back. Whoop whoop. My man. <laughs> I do have to say I enjoy that nun pun. Did not mean to rhyme right there. Just like they probably didn't mean to spell nun. I like it. That's what we'll think. Folks, do me a favor. If if someone was watching this on mobile, can you type into chat how they would donate? Uh, I've received a message saying that they can't get it taken care of, so your help is going to be essential in our, assist, uh, in, in, uh, our success tonight. Um, 
Arcane Soda coming across with these pro tips. Life hack here. Don't lick a nun. Um, I'm going to need some hard evidence on this. Um, I have I have tasted many religious people and the Catholics. They are a step above in terms of flavor. Uh, high salt content, usually low fat. Uh, it cooks well with alcohol. So, uh, no. Uh, 10 out of 10. Have to disagree, but thank you. Uh, just trust me on this one. Okay, all right. You have my trust. Well, folks, uh, these two teams uh, are giving their time, and we we do ask that you give so that they can continue to give. Um, we do have the Treeline Victors playing for Wounded Warriors. Wounded Warriors is a charity that work with veterans here in the States. Um... With the Wounded Warriors, more than 52,000 servicemen and women physically injured in recent military conflicts. Uh, 50, 500,000 living with invisible wounds from depression to post-traumatic stress disorder. Uh, Wounded Warriors does work to assist these veterans in getting back to a normal normal pace in life. Uh, standing beside the people that stood for us and uh, gave uh, so much in conflict to prepare to protect the United States. Um, these uh, numbers speak for themselves, not because every warrior can. Uh, with the support of the community of donors and team members, the wounded warriors give a voice to those in need and empower warriors to begin their journey to recovery. You can get more information at woundedwarriorproject.org. So give them a check. They are being represented by them. And the angry mob is very... Uh, very disgruntled, very unhappy people, but they are big fans of the environment. So their charity tonight is the Sierra Club. The Sierra Club does have a mission statement to explore, enjoy, and protect the wild places of the Earth, to practice and promote the responsible use of Earth's ecosystems and resources, to educate and enlist humanity to protect and restore the quality of natural and human environment, and use all lawful means to carry out these objectives. To get more information, please visit sierraclub.org, and we do appreciate the members of the Angry Mob supporting this charity. 18 seconds left. Lux, Alawi, Kane versus Nico, Ergot, Nocturne. Nickel, thoughts? Thoughts on this. I think that Lux and Alawi and the Kane are going to be annoying. <laughs> we got laser beams that come from over maps. Alawi with her tentacles coming up everywhere. Kane coming, going wherever he goes. But we also have a Nocturne dive in. We have an Urgot that's just a tank. I can't really say much for Nico. I haven't really seen much, to be quite frank. Nico, high impact burst mage with a whole lot of deception capability. Alright. I did see the... I haven't been able to play that much, guys. Apologies. But I have seen the... Uh, her reveal trailer, and I was just like, oh, I would love to play that. <laughs> but anyway, Sig, were people wondering how the donation actually works? Apologies, I think I heard that sometime. Um, in mobile. If someone's looking to donate on mobile. Oh, on mobile. I will I say this, just... Just a pro tip for the guys wanting to donate, if you, one thing with the, the site we're using, Streamlabs, if you use the gift features, you will be required to accept a $5.99 subscription fee to Streamlabs. If you want to forego this, you can uh, confirm and then cancel the subscription. But if you would just like to donate, uh, you just don't or the special texts that are along with it. And then you can just donate. As for the mobile version, I'll take a look at that right now and see how you can donate. Thank you, Nickel. Much appreciated. As I fix this real quick. Teams are getting into a posturing position. We want to show that, and we want to remove time controls and chat. Even though I'm sure they're saying riveting things in there. You'll video. get some dirty looks, that's all I got. <laughs> Wonderful. Yeah, for whoever's using the mobile version, it seems to be pretty similar. You just have to fill out your username, the donation amount you want. You can include a donation message. I would not include a GIF or a an effect 
and then you just click donate at the bottom. It's a bright green button at the bottom, and it should take you through the proper process for uh, your payment method. If that doesn't work, just try refreshing the page. Lots of action going on here. Poke Fest, Poke Fiesta, La Fiesta del Poke, as they say in the Hispanic countries. Uh, a Maya Chan uh, on a Lowie, uh, definitely getting them tentacles up to deal with the original tentacled monster himself. I think I've seen this hentai before. <laughs> Uh, and then we have in the bot side Nico going up against this lust luck Lux. Nope, Lust. That's lust. her name from now on. Yeah, she she knows what she did. Uh, looks like they are going into a poke fest, burst mage versus burst mage, with a standard jungle fight, Kane versus Nocturne. Let's see how this smite fiesta goes. I don't use that too much. Smite engagement. Let's let's I prefer that. That's better. Big trades coming up top, but Great Nerd Odin being taxed, mana-wise. <laughs> Prowler getting, getting feisty with them shoes. Shaking that stir, taking a lot of damage. Ooh, Amaya Chan coming in, doing some major damage to Odin. And that's what I mean, shaking uh, that Nico character, just really a trolly character. Very. Uh, Is she the next Teemo? We'll find out. Next time on Twisted Tree Line. Next time on Dragon. I mean, <clears throat> I'm Twisted Tree Line. Uh, it's probably cancelled after this season. I wouldn't worry about it. No one's ever going to play this map again after we leave. This might as well hey. be a retirement party. We're bringing this map back, man. This is the most play this map has seen in the last five years. Well, it's the strongest competitive play, probably. I don't think Riot's ever really did a big event with this. Or an event, period. I don't know. I'm not Riot. Very standard farming. It looks like they are trading the top side like an island, as it should be, as God intended. Arcane Soda says, for mobile, you have to go to the channel page and then go to the info tab. Okay, so that's where that button is. I personally don't own a cell phone. I communicate strictly through a series of, of body dances and smoke signals. Uh, the fires are set on my limbs, so it is complicated, but I get coverage everywhere. By the way, did you get my smoke signal message today? I did. Those were some very lusty news. Thank you. Please You're welcome. Forward. I'll try my best. You know, it's amazing how far we can go with smoke signals. All the way to West Virginia from Wisconsin. West by God. <laughs> Lots of poke coming across, Greybeard and Odin clearing those tickles out of the lane. It's free farm, free real estate for the six-legged monster. Has got to get lucky, continues the farm push in the bot side. Played Twisted Tree Line for the team fights, and we've had like one? Come on, y'all. Supposed to be a, a mob of disgruntled league players, and... And a tree line victor, whatever that is. No, just really a poke fest for now. Uh -oh. And the junglers are just getting their RVs. Yep, gotta clear them RVs out. That's my favorite Robin Williams movie after all of them. All of them? Uh, it, it's it's the worst Robin Williams movie. Um, Mandy Moore <laughs> know what she did. She should have to do crime. Uh, do crime <laughs> for that crime. Brinko? Gonna be in trouble a little bit. You got a very nasty Nico. Rooted. Ooh! Ooh! Ooh. We are gonna see f first blood going over to this tree line victor squad 
Solo kill from Nico. Alonzi Tardis. Uh, yep, I don't think they really thought. Uh, we'll, we'll see what nerfs are going to come to Nico next patch. We do see the game paused. Not exactly sure why. We haven't received notification of a disconnect or anything. Chaosix is throwing in chat. Um, let I me know if we'll stop throwing stuff around. <laughs> Unacceptable. We'll investigate that. Not for sure what the reason for this pause is, but folks, while we're away, please uh, everyone uh, clap your hands for Fat Lee and his rendition of Country Roads. Um, <laughs> very well done. Please uh, make sure you uh, tip your channel on your way out. Or donate. Um, Chaos X was on is on team you on did i have a stroke okay uh exia and the spicy hot meme have okay one of them are coming back we will work to finding that game has been on pause and we'll resume play things are going fight And we will see the second altar of the map being attempted to take it, and it was taken. Amaya Chan is engaged upon. My computer has a stroke. Probably does throw the ultimate, but doesn't really follow up too well. Uh, as Lux escapes is what I was trying to say there. Uh, but double kill going over to this this Treeline Victor squad. Lux does walk away though. Feels bad, man. Now the guy free ran over the top lane. Might be a dead tower. Maybe not. Mungzik and you're not gonna get them to get off of the West Virginia song. I hope not. This is oh, never mind. They they changed it. <laughs> I'm sorry, Journey Trumps. Who sings Country Roads? Uh, John Denver, you uncultured swine. I'm sorry, it's been covered so many times. God. <laughs> uh, I am so disgusted right now. That man's a living legend. You go walk your mouth. We do see but he's not country. from Virginia. Uh, and that's all really Let alone about West, West Virginia. Virginia. Um, <laughs> it's really about Virginia. But we're moving on. This is a, this is a night about Twisted Treeline. Even, even <laughs> on her night, she doesn't get all the talk. Uh, we do see Greatbeard O trying to very intelligently moving away from that 2v1 situation. Going for that altar that they already own? No, they don't. They got it. Three real estate, folks. Uncontested blue altar for the blue side. Amaya Chen oh. doing stupid damage. Not stupid damage. But doing damage nonetheless. That will make him go away. Nico coming in. Going against a Lux and a Kane. Laser Beam misses. Swing and a miss, Bob. Nico, oh. I know you want to be trolly, but don't be that trolly. Oh no, do it. Fully invest. Bye, bye, bye. Sell that meme. Mountain Jew 32, I love Sig. I love you too. Got all kinds of love tonight, especially for people that uh, are checking us out on Twitch. We really appreciate that. I don't speak Korean. <laughs> Someone start KDA pop <laughs> um. <laughs> Back to the matchup. Um. <laughs> my my um. HN tried to do some damage, but is also returned some damage. 
Nice root on Shaken, but Shaken able to take back. Does Ooh. the stun, but the shields are too much. Can't... Oh, Prowler comes in to confirm the kill. Big cleanup there. Uh, that was that damage from Nico. So, so deceptive. Uh, but folks, at a 4-0 lead that does secure the fastest gold lead in this game mode we've seen so far. At a 3k gold lead right now. Tree line oh pictures. Alright, alright. Gonna take that altar back in the name of the red side. Looks like they are. Crawler taking over an RV. Trying to secure that RV real estate. Amachan going in a little deep in that three person game. Big ultimate coming from Lux, trying to peel off. And uh, Twitch chat asking the important questions. Um, should Lux not be affected by Nocturne's ult because of light? Uh, and should Lee Sin not be blinded by Teemo's dart? Uh, incredible thoughts by incredible people. Thank you. Well, I mean, logically, if you're thinking about how Lee Sin can see, it's got to be either through hearing and or feeling through the ground like Toph from Avatar. So if that poison dart does have poison within it, that's going to mess with more than just your sight. It's going to mess with your entire nervous system. Well, even if you can't see, wouldn't that still affect your balance? We do see people playing League of Legends right now. The wait, why does Ignite work on brand thing? I have no answer for that. It's a different type of fire. <laughs> that it's hotter that, fire. It's, it's hotter fire, folks. It's basic science. <laughs> Would you see the roots uh, being exchanged in the bot side? Gotta get lucky, does land it on shake and not stirred. Big flash coming from Kane, trying to get out, but Prowler following up. Lux ult lands on two, but just not the damage that's needed. Big stun coming across, Prowler taking lots of poke damage from the OG burst mage. Damage coming across on this tier 2 bot side turret. Slow on Prowler in the back side. Tentacles going at this creature of darkness. So, Nickel, uh, being serious, just for a moment, let's not get in the habit of it. What what do you think is leading to the success of this tree line victors lineup? Is what about this comp is so successful? Is it the high mobility? Is it what what is it? It's kinda hard to gauge that still. It seems like we've been getting some different team makeups as we've been going throughout the night. But really it's I think mobility has a key point in it. But also just having good rotations to it, right? I mean, the last matchup we had the gold funnel where it was just a support following the jungler throughout the entirety of the twist tree line, taking on RVs and then taking on ganks. This matchup, I feel like it's a little bit more, a little bit more of the same. I just think that um, the red side is just, yeah, as I say, that Maya Chan is just getting destroyed. Doing some pretty good damage against the Odin, but still. And it peels off. But again, I think mobility is part of it, but also just really being able to confirm those kills, right? Getting lucky when somebody's by themselves and trying to get them down. Alright, that is going away. Sorry about that, folks. As I say that, as I look away, Lux just does amazing damage, apparently, to Prowler. They're not out of this yet, folks. Shake not stirred, trying to do some damage to Maya. Maya's got her dance, his dancing shoes on. I did not assume your gender there, sir. You know, RVs making their way downtown. 
Odin finally getting a little bit engaged. Ooh, Brinkyo, I don't know if you're gonna be able to do much damage to this. Ergot. Gonna take an RV just instead. Ergot coming in, he wants some more Odin, he was an aggressive player, you did not want to mess with that. There you go, Flesh. Doing some damage to Brinko. Brinko, you're gonna want to get out of there, my friend, or at least get to your teammates. My Chan trying to rotate gets caught out. Never mind, rooted Odin. Doesn't really do much for it. My Chan not able to take out the damage for Odin. But it seems that they're gonna get a altar for the troubles. Nice root. Onto Nocturne. Can they do enough damage to him? At least the tentacles are going to be following him as he runs away. Come on. Just got to get engaged here, but that is not the way to do it. Amaya Chen, you're in trouble. Going in even further. Cannot confirm the kill on Shaken, not stirred. Brinko does it for them, but might lose his life as well. That's a double kill for the Urgot. And an ace! Thanks to Prowler, that is going to hurt. Folks, that is a lot of death timers in there. I would just have free reign over the map right now. That really is the name of the game. As soon as you get that ace, that is a very tough thing to get out of. Hanging out the top tower, they're just going to keep this train going. So got 10 seconds before Amaya Chan comes back. They're going to peel off because they know the danger is near. Odin is weak and Prowler is fluffy. So, I'm going to go back and lick his loon, wounds or get some minions for his trouble. Because they are going to have to defend the top lane for that. I think that they're hungry for that bot tower. It's so low, they just want it gone. Did you need that health, Prowler? Sorry for the silence there, folks. Had some issues on my side, but we... I didn't notice. Well. well, your voice is more than enough uh, to keep this all going. It's my reason for living. Uh, Amaya Chan does land some solid poke. Looks like they are staging a comeback here. I'm trying to. Working themselves a little bit into a corner, but... They're not out of the game yet. But if they get another... If they're aced again, I think that that's going to be a lot of trouble. Oh, did you got caught, my friend. Well, never mind, my Shen just gets destroyed. Woo-wee! Lots of ults going off there. Yeah, nothing really to show for it. like that. We're going to get Vile Maw again. Rico coming in trying to take it. Eh. Everybody just peels away. Cowards! Here, got get that bottom turret. Trying to segregate the team a little bit. Cannon and Lux don't know what the heck they're doing. Aloy, what are you doing? Yeah, Nico is doing work, I must say. Another altar as Odin just giggles to himself. Come oh, on. Aya Chan is playing this very defensively, that's good. Gotta get lucky and Brinko. Up, oh, there goes the Vile Maw again. Big ups, I love seeing our man Vile Maw get activated. Could be a little bit more polite. Prowler! You need to be careful, my friend. They don't have their tank with them. That's the problem. If gotta get. If. Ooh, that would have been bad if the other team was there. 
Good lord. We do see the Valma power play uh, victory lap coming across. So, folks, please uh, join us in donating so that we can raise some money for these charities. That money will go into the prize pool. We really appreciate all the donations we've received so far. We're very thankful for that. And let's see if they can ride this victory lap to a win. Treeline victors, that is. Shaken. Take care. My Chen getting dangerously low from Prowler are gonna be taken out with Shaken Not Stirred's help. And they're gonna keep on going through the bot lane. Should probably be a dead tower unless Brick Girl has something to say about it. Doesn't have much to say, unfortunately. Ooh, nice Lux alt, but not able to confirm any kills. You're going to want to have to do so a little bit more damage. Move up a little bit, maybe. Big flash. Stay safe. There. Mm. Come on. Got to get lucky putting in a heroic fight here. Throwing out all the good poke. Ryan, but no cigar. Ooh, you're dead. That's a dead one. Ooh, Amaya Chan coming through, able to get the kill on. Shaking out Sturd might be next. That is a yes, but an was ace a very again. Honest attempt. Uh, Treeline victors will take the win in this one, folks. Looks like they're just rounding it out. Uh, Kane comes up just to see the Nexus option. Ne uh, the Nexus go down. Uh, incredibly well played from both teams. Angry Mob, uh, I hope that this quell. Uh, quelled some of your rage. Uh, twist uh, here in the twisted tree line. The tree line victors, I guess, just know their way around a little bit more. Like as if it was an inside job. <laughs> well, everyone knows that. Uh, <laughs> no, I'm not even. Uh, folks, please enjoy this logo screen just for a second while I tell you again. Uh, thank you to everyone that donated. I do want to shout out to my boy Nickel here. Nickel, thank you for donating. Thanks to everyone that has done Twitch Prime so far tonight. That does support our channel, but that doesn't really uh, play into the prize pool. But we still really appreciate it. You guys keep the channel alive. Uh, and we are going to take a short break. And we will be right back. See ya. <laughs> 